Hi everyone, welcome to my Berlin vlog part two. I just burned my ear with a hair straightener. It hurts like hell. <laughs> um, but yeah, if you haven't watched a part one of this video, make sure to click somewhere around here. I'll have the card on the screen and go watch that first because it includes like four days worth of footage of um, the first part of my trip to Berlin. But yeah, today is my fifth day here and me and Hannah are just getting ready to shoot some videos. We're doing a language challenge and um, we'll also be tasting some candy. I guess we'll have that for breakfast today. I am winning at adulting <laughs> this month. So this is the behind the scenes of YouTube's. Look, all the mess on the <laughs> bed. And we're just testing out a mic because we've never used it before. It's like a road mic. That's so yeah. Uh, Good morning. morning. <laughs> what is also a part of that YouTube live is the technical difficulties. Many of them. We have been trying to like film a video for the past hour, but something's not working because the camera stops recording. We don't know if it's because we have the mic plugged in and the camera doesn't handle it, or if there's something wrong with the SD card. It's so weird uh, though, because we have tried both of my SD cards that were free and then we tried Sandra's. Then we switched from my camera to my roommate's camera who has the same camera. Still didn't work, so now I'm gonna clear off my SD card that I was using for my vlog camera hoping that this one will work honestly I'm so fingers crossed otherwise we might just have to film with this vlogging camera uh, I, mean, I mean yeah you can do it but it's not the same I know but it's nice but it's no DSLR well we'll see we'll see what happens yeah. fingers crossed, fingers crossed. <laughs> we made it we made it work we filmed one video and now the second one is the candy oh tasting god. challenge. I'm so excited. Look at all this goodies. Oh, oh my god. That, yeah. Yeah. Basically, all our lunch. <laughs> yeah. I'm already so energized. I'm gonna be. We'll be bouncing off the walls. I'm gonna be dead. <laughs> <laughs> so, we have finally finished filming. Thank god, after two hours of te technical difficulties. Now we're off to pick up Hannah's jacket. And then we're going to the flea market, which is called... How is it called? <laughs> uh, Flohmarkt am Mauerpark. That. So we find the perfect school for us, the school of life. <laughs> which would probably teach us how to adult, which we don't know how to do. <laughs> yeah, so you can learn how to be creative. Whether you really need um, a relationship or not. Nah. And with this one, it's um, finally done with... I guess procrastinating. Oh, like oh yeah, that one would be a good one to take. Day, so Hannah says I we also love this one, which says emotional baggage. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm gonna make a total. <laughs> that would self. actually be a cool DIY idea. Yes, that would be great. Oh yes, that's gonna be a DIY. <laughs> like the Berlin Wall Memorial and this is basically where the wall went I assume those are like those yeah. represent yeah. the wall as well
just had some really nice waffles and we ordered takeaway pizza as well because we're gonna have a movie night. So excited. Where are we going now? Uh, uh, Kulturbrauerei. Yeah, that's <laughs> What is that? Uh, it basically translates to culture brewery, I guess. But it's basically just a ton of clubs and places. But it's a really cool location, so I thought, why not? So something very exciting just happened today. Look! I hit 4,000 YouTube subscribers. Thank you to everyone who is following me and watching my videos. I really like you. <laughs> That's um, a great start to the day, I think. Now we're gonna have some breakfast and then do some adventuring. Oh my god. Hannah just stepped it's on a poo. <laughs> Oh no, that's, 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 really, bad. that's really bad. That's really bad. I'm gonna find some water in the patch of grass. Oh god. I mean, I do have some water with me, so oh, we can yeah, use that. Too. So we're just walking around this cute little area along the river. We're going to the East Side Gallery today and to Victoria Park. And then in the evening, we have something really exciting planned out, but I'm gonna tell you about it later on in the day. Bizarre. I feel like they drain it for winter, but yeah. why now? It's not so hot cold. Yeah. So this is the Victoria Park. There's no water around because apparently they drained it for the winter time, but it is still very nice and feels very autumnal. I think we're gonna walk up the hill for a really nice view. This hill like reminds me of back home because we don't get a lot of hills like this in London. <laughs> found a very cool tree Hannah sitting on a tree <laughs> and I was trying to take some photos of her and it looked probably looked very comical because I was trying to be one meter taller than I actually am <laughs> so there was a lot of stretching going on <laughs> we are now walking to this park which used to be an airport right yeah it's just an old um, runway yeah and we're gonna do something exciting we're gonna fly a drone we're gonna fly a drone we are here now and look at that amazing sunset i think we're gonna have some very nice footage yes oh i'm excited <laughs> i feel like such a nerd i know such I a know. youtube nerd I feel like a film nerd
that was freaking cool and now I want a drone we are now shopping for groceries because we'll be cooking tonight you'll see some German things and we'll be making pumpkin pie probably oh I just miss like these big European shops because all the ones in London are so tiny and they have so many things here I think it's crazy for me to say that but like I sometimes can't find like the most basic things in London just because all the shops are so like tiny and you have to like drive out to the big supermarkets and obviously I don't have a car so I can't do that um, which is very annoying but yeah I'm a happy monkey right now it's the little things I think I'm getting really old because I get excited about grocery shopping. This is what we're having today for dinner. It may or may not be 3 a.m. right now. And um, <laughs> we, you can't even call it a midnight snack anymore. It's like a 3 a.m. snack. We're having a 3 a.m. Ben and Jerry's ice cream, like a cinnamon bun flavor um, snack. Morning snack, <laughs> early morning snack, breakfast. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> but yeah, we saw this flavor at the store and we just, you know, we just have to give it a go. Let's do this with Casey and I sat in the background. God. I'm so excited. I hope this is good. <laughs> I need like a chunk. Mm. Oh my god, this is actually cinnamon, cinnamon ice cream. I mean, I can only taste half of everything because I'm very congested, so <laughs> yeah. I assume this is She got a bit of a better. cold. Um, it actually does taste like cinnamon buns. Mm -hmm. I am very impressed. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. It is very good. I mean, Ben and Jerry's. They know how to do it. Lots of cinnamon, anything cinnamon. Yeah, cinnamon's mm. good. But anyway, mm. um, I guess I'm gonna talk to you tomorrow. <laughs> Kids, learn from my mistakes and don't go to bed at 4 a.m. if you need to wake up at 9 a.m. I am dead right now. I can barely function. I'm dropping things on the floor. My eyes are all blurry. But I hope my breakfast helps to wake me up. I'm having this jam-filled donut and chocolate milk. Also, don't do that either. Chocolate milk and jam-filled donut is not a good, healthy breakfast option. But yeah, I need some sugar in my sister right now. <laughs> so today we are here in like the shopping district where also like one of the like really old churches is that was like destroyed during the second world war but they kept one of the cars that is destroyed so it's really cool like it's basically a half a ruin i yeah. guess yeah. But yeah it's really cool um i filmed it so i'm gonna insert the footage over here <laughs> now we're going to a department store yeah KDV. KDV. yeah um house does best <laughs> so like Shopping, shopping house. center, <laughs> shopping house um, of the west part. the parliament and up there is like a glass dome that you can actually walk up to and there's like a nice view of the city but we're not doing that today or while I'm here <laughs> because we couldn't get the spot but we'll save it for next time so I'm on my own now um, Hannah has gone to uni and I'll do a little bit of shopping or I guess a uh, window shopping at the mall of Berlin now froze to death because it's so bloody cold outside 
you can't even imagine it's like proper winter it's windy it's raining it's the worst <laughs> but we picked up some food we went to the gemuse kebab right yeah or something like um, that and yeah that's what we have i think i forgot to wrap up yesterday's portion of the vlog but we ended up watching the wolf of wall street leonardo dicaprio was amazing in it i'm not sure how he didn't get um, an oscar for that part but what was even more awesome was seeing katarina chas a fellow slovenian um in the movie playing next to him there were quite a few like slovenian references in the movie which made me very happy um you guys probably won't understand unless you're slovenian but every time slovenia gets mentioned somewhere we all freak out because the majority of the world doesn't even know slovenia exists we're a very small country and it's just exciting when people acknowledge us i guess so yeah that's that about yesterday um i am currently um packing unfortunately hannah's at uni i just said goodbye to hannah's flatmate and his friend who was also visiting him here we've all been hanging out during the past few days and it's so sad that i'm leaving <laughs> like i don't want to go i want to stay here for a little bit longer i definitely hope i'll be coming back soon because berlin has definitely grown on me i did not expect it to be the way it was like very alternative and hipster and like cool and maybe dark in certain like places but I really like it, I love the vibe. And I've been surrounded by like super creative people who like share my passions during the past few days. And it's just amazing. And that's like the environment I kind of thrive in. All my creative juices started flowing. I'm all like energized. I mean, London's nice, don't get me wrong. I love London, but at the end of the day, it's all about the people. Um, so yeah, if any of you like fellow creatives want to hang out in London, please hit me up because I need you in my life anyway like i said i'm set to go but fingers crossed i'll be back very very soon maybe next year during the warmer months that would be great because the weather has been a little bit shit this week and it's been raining it's been very cold um so yeah i would love to come here during like the warmer months that would be cool but I'm gonna finish up my packing now and then wait for Hannah to come home and then we'll probably go grab some lunch or something, I don't know. I shall keep you updated. Hannah's back now and we're off to get some sushi um, to Hannah's favorite place. I have tried sushi twice before. The first time I liked it, the second time I didn't. So today we will find out if I like sushi or not because apparently that's a good one so if I don't like that one then I don't like sushi <laughs> but fingers crossed I do uh, but yeah we're just going there we have two hours for lunch and then we will come back and I'll pick up my suitcase and I'll have to go to the airport <laughs> yeah very sad okay so by the way, so sauce. So it turns out I actually really like sushi. <laughs> it just has to be prepared properly. But yeah, this was so good. But there was so much of it I couldn't finish. But yeah, that's not good today. <laughs> So I guess that's it. I am back home in London now. I feel super strange for some reason. I wish I was still back in Berlin, but I hope I snap out of this funk very quickly because I have a lot of work to do. But yeah, this is the end of my second Berlin vlog. I hope you enjoyed following me around. If you did, you know what you have to do. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't yet. Um, but yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.